key portions of the Patriot Act meant to protect Americans from terror attacks are set to expire at the end of the month. Among them, the NSA's controversial collection of bulk phone data. Should that be extended? The judge says no. You know who he is, Judge Andrew Napolitano, Mr. First Amendment, who doesn't like the idea of those freedoms being willy-nilly trampled on. Well, the Fourth Amendment was written to prevent the very type of warrants that the FISA court issues in secret to NSA, which basically says, here's your warrant. Take right. it and search wherever you want and seize whatever you find. That's called a general warrant, and they're expressly prohibited by the Fourth Amendment. Why? Because the British soldiers did that to the founders, and they wrote the Fourth Amendment to stop it from happening. But is this a freedom of speech issue to you? Is that being violated here? Well, it's more a it's more a right to privacy issue. It's a it's a freedom of speech issue because people will have a tendency to speak with less clarity and, and sharpness when they know that everything they say is being monitored by the government. Now, you may say, does this keep us safer? Well, it doesn't keep us safer. We, we know that these two guys uh, who were killed, thankfully, before they could kill anybody else, uh, in Garland, Texas, uh, last night or this morning, I'm not right, sure when, right. when this happened, had been tweeting and the NSA didn't pick it up. Why didn't the NSA pick it up? Because they pick up everything. Because they don't have the time to sift through the bad guys from the good because they, they take a grandma talking to grandpa. So this and, bulk data that they get where they get millions of phone records bulk, all compromises their ability to hone in on bad Precisely. Guys. They knew these guys were bad guys, particularly one of them had been the subject of a prosecution and a restraining order. All they would have to do is go to a judge with this evidence about him, and the judge would give them a search warrant to listen to him. How much time would that take? Well, you can do it in about 15 minutes today. So it takes very little, very, very little time. You can actually even do it afterwards if it's, a, if it's a, an so emergency So your issue, situation. and you've been consistent on this, your issue for the Patriot Act dating back to George Bush was that uh, be careful what you give away in the interest of protecting people. You compromise a lot of freedoms. Because when, when the government is no longer governed by the same law that govern, governs the rest of us, then the rule of law is gone. And we are subject to the whim of whoever is in power. Right now, we have a person in power that most people, you and I, would not trust our liberties in his hands, uh, Barack Obama. I wouldn't trust, and the Constitution doesn't trust our liberties in anyone's hands.